Hey guys, so today is the start of the summer review series of watches. Watches reviewed in the summer series are watches with bright and funky dial colors, watches perfect for the beach or summer adventures, and watches that just scream summer. Some of these watches I will have reviewed before in different colors, and these are new colors released, or they will be watches I have never reviewed, but perfect for the series. If you are a brand and you want to be a part of the summer series, get in touch. And to the viewers, let me know if there is a watch with a summer vibe that you want reviewed. So the first watch in the series is this Zodiac Super Seawolf Pro Diver. Now with this pistachio dial. And not just a pistachio dial, but a full loom pistachio green dial. Like the original Super Seawolf Pro, this is a 42 millimeter case with a seven link bracelet, 300 meters of water resistance, sapphire crystal, ceramic bezel insert, and now with a new movement, the STP 1-21 COSC movement. Pricing is to be $2,295 and it is scheduled to be released on June 17th, 2024. Let's get into the details of this perfect summer watch. Fans of the Zodiac brand have probably seen the other version of this watch, the Red Bar version. Red Bar did a collab with Zodiac to bring back the Red Dot series, so the same watch as this one, but with a red dot on the dial, the case back, and a black and red nylon strap. Now, that one is limited to 200 pieces, and legit, these two watches are the same watch except the red bar version brings back the iconic red dot. And as I record this video, they are currently available on the Zodiac website. And that brings it to this version, the non-red dot. I'll throw up all the specs here on screen, but I will also direct you to my review of the original Super Seawolf Pro Diver when it was first released a few years ago. Since this watch, with the exception of the movement and a full loom dial, is the same as the original I reviewed, I will link to that review in the upper right hand corner and down in the description as well. I go into much more thorough detail in that video than I will here. So those of you that have seen that video or own or are familiar with this watch, it is the same case here. This is the stainless one, not titanium. And it's still a wonderful looking watch, a wonderful dive watch, and possibly the best looking Zodiac dive watch they have released in the past 20 years. The case itself is all brushed, vertical brushing on the hard angled case with high polishing on the crown and the bezel edge, which is a nice touch and complements the polishing in the seven link bracelet. Everything works the same as the original I reviewed, a nice crisp bezel with that dome ceramic insert, which is easy to grasp from any angle and easy to turn. The crown is large with thick and chunky crown guards. And again, it's pretty easy to operate and screw back down. I haven't noticed any issues. The dial here is the star of the show, of course. I mean, just look at that pistachio green color. I love this color. And I have a lot of watches lined up for this summer series, some with blue dials, other with green dials, but this one is quite unique. The hands are all done in black, as is the outline of the indices, and you will notice the red triangle on the bezel and the red water resistance text on the dial, just enough pop of color, and I love how it looks. I will state that on the website and press photos and probably in my own photos and even in this video, it looks proper red, but I will tell you in person, there is a slight pinkish hue, almost a faded red color. But yes, this green dial is the showstopper here. And if you're looking for a cool dial for the summer, well, come on. And of course it is a full loom dial. So let's show some loom. As you can see, the entire dial and bezel light up, everything lights up, and it looks amazing in the dark. The only thing I will say is that the indices themselves are dimmer than everything else. Not exactly sure what type of loom was used on them, but let's be honest, you're never going to have trouble seeing this one in the dark, that is for sure. The bracelet is the same 7-link bracelet, 
And to my knowledge, this one won't come with another strap, so it is the bracelet only. And I do like this bracelet. I liked it on the previous version I reviewed, and it's still beautiful and very comfortable. It just drapes on the wrist perfectly. The clasp is still the same as well. No dive clasp here, but it is not just your standard dual deployment as each side has the stretch link to give some extra length if your wrist starts to swell up a bit. I think it all works fine, but I would like to see some micro adjust holes added in somehow to help attain a better fit on the wrist. And speaking of on the wrist, here it is on my seven and a half inch or 19.05 centimeter wrist. And just as before, it wears great. 42 by 50 millimeter is a great size for me. And I do have to comment again how great it feels on the bracelet. And this really is a great looking watch in a crowded sea of dive watches, but it's a great looking piece. Now I do want to mention a few things that have me scratching my head, less to do with the watch, but more to do with the pricing and availability and marketing. So this one is the standard model of the pistachio dial, no red dot. The red dot version is a 200 piece only version in a collab with red bar. Now that model came out first, and then this one is dropping on the 17th. All well and good, but what I'm not getting is the price being exactly the same. This version should be a little less in my opinion. You get more with the red bar version, being it has an extra strap and of course the red dot, and it's very limited. All I could say is maybe my contact was wrong at what price this will launch at, and I hope it's a touch cheaper than what I was told. All that said, if you hover enough on the Zodiac website for a bit, you will get a pop-up to get $100 off, so that will bring the price down. And if you order between now and June 16th, any watch from the Zodiac website, you get a free Pelican-style six-slot watch box. I didn't get a chance to see one in person, but they look like a nice case, so that's cool as well. Funny enough, that promotion ends the day before this watch drops. But like I said, the red dot red bar version is currently available. So that is a look at this cool new summer inspired Zodiac Pro Diver. I hope you guys will enjoy the summer series. I got a lot of bright and vibrant colored watches in hand and lined up for these reviews. Plan on doing these reviews through August. So I hope you are subscribed and have notifications on. If you can, please like this video, and I always want to hear from you, so let me know what you think of this watch down in the comments. This is Don Evans from Watch Report. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.